an option, you know, my dad's a martial arts, you know, martial arts teacher and obviously my granddad was with me, so it was definitely an option, but my mum was just like, you like, don't want to ruin your face, you know, yeah. you know and, and I, I wanted to play a team sport, I've always played team sports, so I wanted to, you know, if, if nothing ever happened, you know, that would have been something further down the line. You, know. you mentioned martial arts, did you ever take martial arts? Well, my dad was an instructor, so mm -hmm. I never took it officially, but, you know, every time I'd walk past him in the, in the, in the hallways, he'd grab my hands and start trapping and start doing some sort so not officially but a lot of pass rushing has a lot to do with hands yeah, how, how much did you incorporate into that well there you go I mean funnily enough mm -hmm. something that I've been doing my whole life is something which relates to this game you know heavily especially in my position okay. well that's the one who you saw in the locker room your first day and you were like wow I'm actually in the NFL locker room with this guy who was that guy for you probably AP I AP, think yeah. yeah I think AP was actually when when I first, you know, Googled American football, AP was the first person who came up. Yeah. And I seen his highlights and I was like, wow, I could do that. So, I mean, it is kind of, it's a bit weird, but it's, you know, it's cool, you know, that now I'm on the same team as him. Yeah, I can apologize, I can't handle it a little but what's been the biggest adjustment for you? At the speed of the game, I think, you know, like, I definitely took to it very well in college. I'm very coachable and, and all that, but um, the speed of the game, um, the speed of how quickly you have to learn things, you know, the size of the playbook. Um, obviously, I'm coming in a week late for OTA, so I'm really trying to catch up. But uh, so those are definitely the things that I think is a lot different than college. Yeah. Where is your confidence level? Because obviously, I would assume you wouldn't be doing this if you didn't think you could make a living here. <laughs> oh no, I, coming here, obviously the first day, you know, you just this anxious feelings and stuff. Like, what's it going to be like? I want to get my first, I want to get my first hit. I want to go against my first NFL offensive lineman. And, you know, I did that. You know, I won one of my first pass rushes with a spin. So as soon as you get out, you just and you feel good, and like, I know I can play at this level. What is that like knowing that you're, you won't play this year, and that you're limited by that, but you might have an opportunity? I mean, it's it's a mixture of frustration, but then appreciation at the same time, because you know it gives me the, the chance to to learn and really focus on development. But being a competitor, you know, being an athlete, you know, and playing this game, you want to play. And you know, I've never ever since I've started playing this game, I've always been the top guy, and I've always been the guy who's in on the first team reps, so it's, it's an adjustment for me to be on the sideline and watching, but also it's a blessing to be able to to learn and develop and see where I can be next next season, how I can contribute to this team next year. Kind of it's a long game. Yeah, it's the long game, you know, it's frustrating, but it's also a massive blessing. Yeah. You mentioned martial arts, what other sports did you play growing up? I played soccer, rugby. That was pretty much it. So I played a little bit of basketball, but it was really like martial arts, soccer, and rugby. What are your thoughts just about the city of New Orleans itself? What do you think about New Orleans? I think it's a great city. You know, when I first came here last week, I just I went to Bourbon Street, I went to the French Market, got me some authentic New Orleans food. I think it's great. It's got kind of like a little island vibe to it. I don't know, but I'm really excited to learn more about the city and stuff like that. Yeah. yeah.